There once was a team who liked to be mean. She liked to expose flaws that people would hide till they felt worthless and absent of pride. When someone would ask her for help with their work, she'd mess up their answers and act like a jerk. And if someone came to her feeling all down, she seemed all concerned, but then she'd laugh like a clown. Each day she met somebody new, she'd act like their best friend and be sweet and all true. But after hearing their secrets and promising to prevail, she'd announce to the world every name and detail. Her smartphone was filled with people she'd name whenever she needed a person to blame. And every time she promised to wait, you can bet she'd be gone by the start of the date. Well, word about her started to grow, that she wasn't the type person people wanted to know. They called her nasty and petty and rude, because nobody liked her bad attitude. Her invites and messaging eventually all ended, and even her sister left her unfriended. She came to the point where nothing made sense, and knew at that moment she had no defense. As she looked in the mirror and saw who she was, thoughts in her head left her saddened because all of her conniving and lying and meanness galore was costing her friendships and happiness and more. It was time to be honest and true to herself. It was time to take her soul off the shelf. So she made good to those she had burned and she did damage control to those she had spurned. She stood up for those that others called odd and swept herself clean before her own loving God. When conflict was king, she tried to bridge foes. And when meanness prevailed, her kindness arose. Now, her change in demeanor didn't make life all sweet. She still had her troubles. She still had big feet. But when she woke up each morning and looked in the mirror, something bigger and better seemed to be near. She felt happy inside and wanted to sing. Eh, but that would be dorky and comments would fling. So she decided to be her own best self and listened to the voice she had taken down from the shelf. It didn't matter if some people liked her better as mean. She knew the face that they hadn't seen. And going forward, she promised to be a once-chained soul that had been set free.